A lot of people don't think it can ever replicate money, but many people come into crypto or Bitcoin because of speculation mostly, because the price fluctuated a lot. So if you go in at the right time when the price goes down and you buy them, and after a while the price goes up quickly, then you earn a lot of profit. So many people are interested in it in terms of speculative investment. But it also has the downside because you know that you can go in at the wrong time. If you buy it expensively and then the price goes down, then um, you lose a lot of money. That can happen as well. One thing is that um, to ever become fiat money in a country, the regulator would need to endorse it. But I don't think any regulator would ever endorse any privately created cryptocurrency. So the answer is probably not. For the cryptocurrency, the main areas including the use of crypto as the means of payment. Because for the Bank of Thailand, wider adoption of crypto as the means of payment could have impact on the financial stability of the country. So they quite worry about using crypto as a means of payment. So for Thailand, if you're talking about what I would expect to see. More traders will open account to invest in digital assets, and for the business sector, more of them will use the investment token to raise funds. Because right now we have the IPO, so I think in the future, the business sector will start to issue investment token to raise funds. Unlock the science, encapsulating the scientific world with Jula Radio Plus.